So one of my clinical subspecialties is Parkinson's disease, and it's a, it can be a very complicated disorder. It's not too uncommon. Uh, probably the second commonest neurodegenerative disorder in the U.S. apart from Alzheimer's disease. And um, as many people know, some of the conditions or the issues that patients with Parkinson's have uh, are very visible, and that's tremors or balance problems. But a patient with Parkinson's will tell you that a lot of their challenges are the invisible component to that. Things like memory and thinking challenges that may not even show up objectively functionally, but still limit their own ability and their own sense of well-being. Certainly the mood dysfunction and the mental health issues can predate everything we see very visibly. And so having a good understanding of that really allows me to engage and to understand patients much better and to build that relationship much better. And also just to be aware of some of the challenges that they may be uh, lie, lie ahead. Um, but in doing so, we can try to meld some of the latest science and some of the liter latest literature out there, giving them exposure to what we had spoken about, you know, the, the most advanced fitness regimens that, that could potentially slow, slow down the impact of the disease, even though it doesn't necessarily slow the disease itself. Um, aiding in lifestyle changes like nutrition, the Mediterranean diet which we mentioned, and sleep hygiene, which can definitely have a profound effect on functional overall. And then choosing the right medications and having residents have the exposure to the right types of medications in the right doses at the right times makes all the difference as a whole. Because we remember that the goal of treating Parkinson's disease is quality of life. Not so much, unfortunately, curative because there isn't one, but a functional cure early on and, and then a functional benefit in trying to maintain their quality of life for as long as possible and to the level which makes sense for them from a personal standpoint.